My name is Patrick Serino. Uh, I'm an associate professor in chemical engineering, and this is a part of the undergraduate chemical engineering practices lab, which is a senior lab. This laboratory has been here since the building was constructed in 1968. Behind me is a distillation column for separating chemicals um, based on differences in boiling point, and it's the most common uh, separation technique used in the chemical engineering industry. You know, many decades ago, much of the, the separation, the distillation was controlled manually with just hand, a lot of valves, you know, with people turning with their hands. And now, you know, we've, we've upgraded and improved over the years with adding computer control and automation, uh, process control loops, things like that. I've uh, given lab tours down here with students uh, when their parents are visiting. And I've heard from uh, multiple parents that they were uh, their alumni and they actually worked in this lab. We only do the practices, but a lot of this might have been in the old days unit operations lab. Things break sometimes, so they have to be replaced. The column behind me is insulated, but it's actually glass inside there. And unfortunately that can break sometimes. It's very expensive, but it gets replaced. Chemical engineering hasn't changed uh, really <laughs> for many, many decades. The technology, maybe the equipment gets advanced, the controlling of the equipment gets advanced, but the processes are the same. Theory still applies and the lab still applies. 